With the introduction of the weight loss injectable medications, we saw really um, roughly a doubling in effectiveness from the previous oral medications. So the biggest problem has been access to the medications, I would say, both in terms of uh, insurance coverage and then sometimes availability from the pharmacies. GLP-1 is the hormone that is naturally occurring that this medication was developed to, to mimic. So the uh, pharmaceutical grade medications like Ozempic, which is also called semaglutide, is basically a synthetic made GLP-1, which is the human form of the hormone. Interestingly, the GLP-1 hormone goes up naturally after bariatric surgery. That's one thing that a lot of people aren't necessarily aware of. Your own natural production of GLP-1 goes up substantially, and that's thought to be one of the mechanisms by which individuals who have bariatric surgery, number one, lose weight, but also, secondly, improve with their diabetes. The best utilization of them, and what, in my opinion, the best practice would be to use these medications in conjunction with a program such as ours where you're going to get close follow-up, you're going to get at least a monthly visit with the provider. Mm -hmm.